Hey everybody, Bandicoot Commando here and welcome back to Spyro 4. Last time, we did... Ba -ba 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 -ba. We did, we did, we did, we did. We did Cloud 9. Unfortunately, I wasn't really able to finish it, so... I'll have to go back in there to... Uh, see what I can gather later. Because I, I would need Sparks' pointing ability to find what's left, because I do not know, so... Uh, today, we're going to first go back to the Dragonfly Dojo and not only get the last Dragonfly, but see if I can get the remaining gems. If I can't, then I will then instead go to Honey Marsh. Because even though Monkey Monastery is technically the next level, we do have enough... We do have enough... Dra well, not yet exactly, but when we get this last Dragonfly, we'll have enough Dragonflies to actually go to Honey Marsh. So... And that's where I'd like to go, because technically I feel like that should have been one of our next levels. But uh, first, finally to get our final breath ability. Spyro, the magic of this sacred rune will bestow upon you the power of ice strength. Uh, it says will grant, but he said will bestow. Alright, that's it. We have all of the abilities we can get. So the dragon's only here for decoration. Ice Breath! You breathe ice on anything, it freezes, and then you charge into it. Really helpful. Also, it's good to take out big enemies, too. Certain big enemies. Okay, first, we'll go back to Dragonfly Dojo, and I w we will do that one mission that we couldn't do. And... I may or may not be able to get all the gems, because after looking back at the first video, I think I know a few spots where I'm missing some, so I will be sure to take care of that. Also, as we wait, uh, I'm not going to say much, but I am working on a little something. Well, technically, I'm not working on it, but someone else is. What it is, uh, after this Let's Play, you will see in time. But it's a little something for the channel, is all I could say. But you shall see. We shall all see, and I hope... I can't wait to see the results myself. Alright, here we are. Oh, every time you come back to Dragonfly Dojo... You did a great job saving the Dragon Master, Spyro. Yeah, every time you come back, Zoe will always say that. Okay, first off, yeah, I was gonna say... I left some here, and I could have swore there were some underneath, too. <coughs> so, let's use the ice breath. Alright, so, um, where else would I be I think I'm missing one over by the... Yep, there's one. But we're still short on some, so... I can only hope that I'm missing them, and they're, like, underneath these little things here. Ah, this game doesn't it cease to amaze me with the little glitches. Die! Okay, let's see. Okay, there's nothing under that. Maybe it's the next one. I'm missing it. Oh, there was one. Okay. Man, they were deceptively hidden. You know, let's freeze this guy. Oh. Yeah, it can be a bit wonky when it comes to the ice. Okay, nothing. I'm going to be extra... Extra observant of where the gems are. Because if that one was near the steps, then I'm pretty sure... I am pretty sure I will see it at any area. Oh boy, okay. Did not like how the camera was there. Okay, nothing. Okay, I'm pretty sure we'll be missing some out here. Okay, so while we're at it, first, you guys, once again, leave the kid alone. Somehow I hit him, I don't know how. Let me get rid of all the guys first. It's so misty. Okay. 
and just making sure by going up here. Ah, uh, yep, there's one. We're still short on some. How many, uh, select? How many do we have left now? Uh, we're missing five, so we are missing a blue one. Or possibly five red ones, but pretty sure it's a blue. Question is, where can it be, though? Where have I not figured where it would be? Okay, so for this one, first we need to, let's talk and initiate it. Spyro, my kite got stuck up in the tree. Could you get my kite out of the tree for me, Spyro? I can't reach it because there's nothing here to stand on. Just me. Okay, so you freeze the NPCs and you use them. Uh-oh. Um. Um. Oh, okay, it does work. It's just a bit wonky. Uh, I don't like how that's flashing. But that's how it's supposed to be done. There's your kite, kid. Thanks for getting my kite down, Spyro. My buddies RJ and Dougie are flying their kites today, too. Have you seen them, Spyro? I know where they're at. Okay, first, let me just check this and make sure I'm not missing anything, because I'd love to get the last gem and get out of here. I swear, if it's in a place where I should be expecting it, then I'm going to be upset. Nope, nothing is hidden and deceptively here. No, maybe I should just keep it like this. Despite the camera wanting to turn around. Nope. Hmm. Yeah, and money bags will always stay there. Uh, too bad we can't see him anywhere else because he had to be cut so short from the game in the end. Okay, nothing there. Oh, wait. Uh. Thanks, Spyro. These gems are music to my ears and will do wonders as inspiration for my poetry. Yes, I know. <laughs> you deserve it. Oh, you can't break them out. There you go. One more little zap for good measure. Okay, I am looking as carefully as I can. Nope, that's the wing. I, uh... I don't want to test it, but I don't think the wing shield can protect you from physical attacks. They have to be projectiles. Okay, so... It's not there, so... Am I missing it over here, maybe? I'll help you out in a bit, kiddo. Let me just look around. So many lives. I don't see anything, so... Is this RJ or Dougie? I've been trying to climb this bonsai tree all day. There's something shiny up there, and I just know it's the kite I lost last summer. Can you save my kite, Mr. Spyro? That tree is so hard to climb. Maybe there's another way to reach the kite. Oh, it sure is hot out here. Don't worry. I'll cool you off. Um, Spyro, can you... Thank you. Okay. There's your kite, kiddo. <sighs> that was cold. But you saved my kite, so I guess I should thank you. Look, Spyro, look what came out of the tree when you saved my kite. A baby dragonfly. 
Hey, it flew away. It's all right. Uh, Mooney. Hey, it's Mooney. I guess uh, Dougie's or dra er, dragonfly. Dougie's um kite we saved when we were first here counted still. I didn't know that. I thought it would reset. So, all right, that takes care of that. Uh, no, I can't glide that far. All right, well, we got all the dragonflies here, and more importantly, we got just enough to go to Honey Marsh. So, first, I want to see if I can at least still find wherever that last gem is. I just know it has to be a, pur er, a purple. I just know it has to be a blue. But where can I be missing it? What am I doing? That's breath change. That's wing shield. Ah, Sparks, I could have swore you had your pointing ability unlocked very early. No, I like how the magic's blowing out like that. Where can you be, Bluey? Where can you be? No. No. It better. I will say, because of how glitchy this game can be, I think gems can glitch to the point that you can't find them. So that better not be the case. Otherwise, I'm in trouble. I could save Dougie's kite again. I just won't get anything out of it. If I can't find it, then yeah, I'm just going to have to come back here next time. Whoa there. Easy. Hmm. I don't see anything up here. One thing I always hated from Spyro games is the fact that when you have to find that last gem and you just don't know where to find it. Which is why I'm glad that at least regarding Spyro 3 they gave Sparks the ability to point out any missing gems. I doubt it's here. Yep, and we're back where we started. Hmm. Oh, and I forgot to save Dougie's kite. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Maybe I'm missing one up here. Wait, that's a red, but still. Well, then shoot. I don't know where else to look. I'm just going to have to wait until I get the ability to point and come back here later. All right, then. That's good enough for me, then. We'll just have to come back. Alright, I'll have to do at least. Oh well. Also, I should say, I hope the sound sounds okay because after that last part where I had to be with mom, I'm not sure if the settings are back where they should be, but oh. Whoops, but I'll change I'll change them accordingly if they don't sound right to me. Oh man, I need to lay down. Oh, that feels good. Oh man, I should say I've been having a miserable well, not a miserable day, but uh what am I to say? I have I've I'm going to sound really sad saying this, but I have little to no friends. My girlfriend's in Tennessee. I feel like I haven't really accomplished much, so I don't know what to do. Okay, so if we want, we could go this way and check out what's available, but I say nay to that, and I'd rather just go back to here and take care of that. Um, let me see this thing. Okay. 
Like I said, that thing is really important for later. You might even recognize it. Oh, whoa. Sorry, it's just the little mic was touching my cheek and I just just surprised me there. All right, off to Honey Marsh. We will go there and I'll see how my, many dragonflies I can get because at this point treasure doesn't matter since money bags doesn't even appear anywhere else in this game. Hello there. Well, that should do it, Spyro. Hop aboard the raft and get ready for the Honey Marsh Rapids. I'm pretty sure Tom Kenny does the voice of these guys. Because I can recognize, like, his, his, uh, his little southern, western voice he can give to characters. And, yeah. So now we just float down this river of honey. Although they don't look like rabbits to me. Oh, the thunder and lightning in the distance. How? Why do you need dragonflies to get a boat or a raft working? Like, I can understand maybe the stones and the UFO and the, the swirly thing, but how do they get a raft and a, a boat to work? Well, maybe for the boat. Like I said, it had no sail or engine, so it needed magic. But a raft just to float down a river of honey? That sounds simple enough. Alright. Here we are at Honey Marsh. Okay, let's see. I hear magic. And little piggies are here. So, uh... Talk to him. Jimmy Bob, maybe, or someone else. Welcome to Honey Marsh, Spyro. Them Riptop critters have messed this here place up, but good. Opie? Why'd you call him Opie? Or Opie? I tells you what, I'll make you a deal as sweet as honey. There are some honey stills draining all the honey from Honey Marsh. You help us get rid of them, and any of them there dragonflies you're going on about that you find along the way, you can keep. Just keep that between us now, yeah. Okay. Yeah, sounds fine to me. You know, they kind of look like... He... They, they kind of look like Totodile in a way, just minus the hat and the and the clothing. They just kind of look like Totodile. Okay, these things, uh, they do contain gems, and don't be afraid, the bees aren't going to hurt you. Okay, so that. Hmm. I think this is just here. Wow, look at that honey fall. That's not animate. Well, it's made of honey, so I guess it would have to work. Um, okay, just wanted to test and see what it would do exactly. Like, I didn't know if I get stuck in sync or if it would hurt me like that. Get a little piggy. Wow, just look at this. Alright, let's get going. Let's actually get going. I'll admit, I actually don't like honey, to be honest. I mean, the only time I get honey is if I have a bit of a sore throat. Anyway, we got those rip talks, the, the banjo wielding ones. Doing some dueling banjos, are you? Yep, there you go. They actually have a funny laugh if they hit you. Okay, those guys. They have... For a, for a big enemy, they got laser guns. Ow! Get rid of the, I'll call them Hillbilly. Hillbilly Riptox and the Banjo ones. Okay. Still, them, them hillbilly ones with the guns, they got some good range. Moment they see you. Yeah, they'll then immediately try to take their shot at you. They got some good range. That's why you gotta take them out quickly. Okay, I need to find a piggy soon. Oh, there's the, uh... 
I knew it! That's why I hate it when they place containers near either ledges or hazards. Them, those assholes they are. Oh, I was gonna say, you may be wondering if there's bees. Well, of course there's, ow. Oh, I gotta get back. I gotta, I gotta get out of there. I need sparks. Let's hope there's some piggies back where Jimmy Bot. Yeah, I see them piggies. They don't just raise honey, they raise piggies too. There you go, Sparks. Oh, hello. Get that. No, no, don't shoot me. Okay. I want to get rid of him. And somehow I disabled the the thing without meaning to. Man, why would Riptox want honey? The reptile, them rip rip reptiles. Them reptiles don't want honey. But then again, considering Donkey Kong Country where King Karul and his Kremlins want bananas, which makes no sense. Although they tried to make sense of it by saying he wants to make a banana milkshake or apply it to his skin to look young, I think. I don't know why I'm still talking like a hillbilly. Okay, that's another one turned off. Okay, just making sure I'm not missing anything. There we go. I guess any time treasure falls in hazards like that, they'll just bounce out. Is that even a platform? Oh, it is. It's just... Oh, I hear thunder. Yeah, it's... It's storming over there. Oops. I'm not getting out of here anytime soon. Yeah, every time you die a Spyro, you hear a gong ring like that. Really? Man, that's a walk. I don't even know if I saw if, if I saw Zoe or not. Unless I've been skipping her by accident. It's not my fault that I can't see her or that she lacks range to shoot me. Yeah, I don't see Zoe here. Unless it's one of those levels that's like all oh, very long and little to no checkpoints, which this better not be the case. Okay, and here. Okay, we're back. Man, that rain, though. Hey, wait a minute. I heard a na 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 na, -na. Yep. There's a thief over there. I'll chase after him in a bit. Let me try to clean this up at least. <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, um, what have I discovered? Ha! <sighs> it's time. Okay, great camera angle. It's times like this that you gotta admire an ocean of honey and wonder why you're standing on a little waterfall of honey but not receiving damage. It's times like that that make you wonder. Okay, so let me just go around, make sure everything's good to go. Finally! Thank you, Zoe. Okay, you. Uh, he was glitching out like crazy. Hey, who'd we save? Duckweed. Ain't that a, ain't that an actual plant? Okay, uh, let's turn that off. Oh, whoa. 
Oh, man. Oh, I hear... I'm hearing a lot of things go on. So, I hear a portal some... Oh, there it is. Okay. What's the portal? So, hold on. I'll... Let me go in and... I'll go in in just a bit. Let me... All right, let's go in and see what this has to offer. <coughs> uh, I know I only... I remember what both minigames are, but I don't remember what this one was, though. So we're just going to have to wait and see. Staring, 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 staring... Staring at the white ceiling of my room while Spirit, Spirit, Spyro goes down the vortex of doom.